G'day, Mike from Aussie Mike's Bees with another laser video. I know it's only a couple of days since I put up the last one, but I've got a little project and it's raining at the moment, can't do any work. So what I've got to do is, is fix up the seat out of my mini excavator. I've got a Bobcat E20 that I do excavation with and it's been out in the weather so that the upholstery is all cracked and broken through and it's turned into crap. So I'm going to take the seat down to the upholsterer and get them to put on marine quality upholstery. But when I pulled the seat off the excavator today, I found this. Now, don't get me wrong, bobcats are a great machine, but one thing they're not great at is paint. And so this is the base that the seat sits on and it's just gotten rust under the paint and it just keeps peeling it off it's a shocker so I thought I'm going to remove the seat and I can laser blast this back blast it all back to bare metal and give it a new coat of paint so I'll just flip him over I'll just speed this up because you don't need to watch me doing it slow motion There you go, look at that rust all the way through there and under here as well, it's peeling up. Now that's got some foam on that. There's some sort of insulation, probably heat insulation from the engine.
Well, that's pretty much it. There's still a bit of heat in there. I, I can't pick that up, but it's pretty much ready to paint now. I'm happy about that. It took about 20 minutes, 25 minutes, I suppose, and there was a fair bit of grunge. I hesitated a bit about whether to remove that foam altogether. I peeled it off and then there was all the goopy, sticky stuff and I thought, let's see what happens. So I cranked it up to 100% and burned all of that off and it created a lot of smoke, but the breathing gear makes it easy work to get through. And so that's once that's cooled off, I'll hit that with paint and that'll be as good as new. So Aussie Mike's Bees, another non-B video. Thanks for watching.